んなに世界が綺麗だって気づかなかったな司令官からの命令で 2B さんのメンテナンスを担当することになったんですこれから定期的にチェックしますねこの記録を聞いた者がいたら伝えてほしいことがあるもしヨルハブタイ所属Hello. How are you to see even to s e e v e n i n g Yeah, how are you to s e e v e n i n g chat? You're probably gonna hear a little Tibbert doing a lot of meowing tonight, poor baby. They usually have their wet food for dinner, but they're on this. Anti inf um, not anti inflammatory, anti um, what's it called? The one and you don't get allergic, and analgesic, I think, diet, which means that uh, he doesn't get to have wet food for dinner. That means the boys don't have wet food for dinner. Alex is okay, he's a little bit grumpy, but Tibby's angry, aren't you, Bumpus? He's not happy about it. The change to the routine, and I, I understand it would be hard. Alright, when we last left off. Yeah, what happened when we last left off? Do you remember? No? <laughs> That's okay. So we need to get to the center of the city ruins. Looks like we're going back to the, the broken city. Kind of, kind of place, you know? Factory hangar. Factory furnace. Oh, there's a lot of, a lot of places that are offline. There's something out here. I think that's that place that we can't reach yet. And look, the resistance base. Oh, that's Pascal's village. Yeah, so lots of stuff happened on last episode. We fought a lot of bosses.、Uh, the machines attacked Pascal's village. We managed to defend them. We went into the factory and we met the become as gods, become as gods, become as gods robots. We fought a big fucky crab. And we are now. Off to the center of the ruins. Let me turn this volume up real quick. There we go. Alright, let's go. This way, I think. Oh, I don't want Beast Lord. I want. I know, I don't want Beast Lord. That's crazy. I want to change Beast Lord to. Virtuous treaty, virtuous dignity. Machine spear. Have the machine set. Whoa, gotta remember how to play. Ain't no turn based mode in this game, really. I'll turn the, the pod、uh, light on, just so we can see what we're doing. And we need items. We need to find a, a friend to sell us some items. Ooh, I don't like these things. They look scary. But luckily, we've got a, we've got a pretty good chipset、uh, at the moment, which means that anytime we deal damage, we heal a little bit. We've got that vampire going on, we've got that、uh, Bloodborne regain mechanic, you know? 
Ooh. Found a little treasure cave. A lot of titanium alloy. I'm not sure what that does. I wonder if it's a crafting material. Because in order to level your weapons up, it's like Dark Souls, you need the, uh, the relevant materials as well as money. Here we have the alien spaceship. Uh, is it... Whoa. Oh, there's a, there's a guy. Zelda. We'll pray for Zelda. And we'll take some of their stuff. Pinch their change. And no. Okay, cool. Very curious to see where the story goes. I've been very much enjoying the story of this game. I cannot say I've been enjoying the story of Transistor. Maybe if I consumed the story in a different format, I would enjoy it more. What do you think? Alright, do you reckon this is the way? This will take us down to that, like, uh, recreation city, perhaps white one where we found 9S captured by Adam who we just annihilated feels like a lifetime ago yeah here it is <gasps> Alex the, the boys are scratching on my brand new couch why are you always doing that Reach the center. No. Yeah, the copied city. This is what it's called. So this is where our big confrontation with Adam was. But it is not where we're supposed to be. Okay. Well, back we go. I guess we'll go to that area we didn't go to before. This little nook. Hopefully that's a healing item. I can't remember if we topped up and I cannot bother to check right now. Look at that. It's like a tree. Do you reckon that's a mimic or something? <laughs> That'd be alright. Just open it up, get annihilated. Alright, back we go. Back we go. I see you up there. I see you, McLean. Start watching Kraken play Kenshi last night. Just just started watching the VOD of his like Hive playthrough. I'm curious as to whether I would enjoy playing that game. I feel like it would tick the boxes of uh, what I enjoy doing in games. I'm unsure as to whether I would enjoy the gameplay of Kenshi. So I'd love to have someone, like, give me the skinny on it. Go to the center of the city. City Ruins, okay. Hang on, is City Ruins, that's where the big crater is, right? Or is that the abandoned, like, hab block? Oh, yes, yeah, literally just over there. Alright. 
Climb up the ladder, brother. Camera automatically did that. I did not do that. Don't worry. It wasn't me. Look at Pod bopping. Fuck was that? Hello? How do I get out of here? That, like that. Hello? Hello? Lone swordsman saw a machine with dreams at a garbage dump. You pray for symbol. Alright, I need all the allies I can get. I think something scary is about to happen. So cool. Well, here we are at the- oh! Tim. He's like that bear. He's like that one bear. From Danganronpa. He's like that bear from Goddamn Rompo. Darkness. You're presenting me. Absolute horror around my seat. Oh, he's got punch arms. Woo! Yeah, he's doing that anime like yell. Woo! He's got fucking gunbuster arms. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, we got tons of recoveries. Fantastic. Oh. Oh. Yo! Oh, I thought I had to jump up on top of these. I hope I do, because that would be awesome. Whoa! Fuck. Alright, whenever he screeches, we gotta dodge. Shit. God damn it, come on! <gasps> Let me on! Oh, come on, please! There it is! No, I went through it. There it is. <gasps> oh, as soon as I jump on. Shit. Whoa. He's healing. I, I can barely see what the fuck's going on here. No! We're never abandoning Bean. Oh, fuck. We're starting off pretty, uh... You know, it's pretty exciting. I thought we'd start off, do a couple of side quests. Oh, he's hacking in! He's entering the Matrix. Oh, we're halfway there. Yeah. 
Oh, I swear I dodged that. I swear I put the input in. Oh! He hit me with the back, the backhand. Yeah. It's very difficult to see what the hell's going on here. His attacks are quite fast to uh, to come out. There's not much uh, like what do you call it? Preempting or when when you can see it? telegraphing. There we go. That's what I was looking for. There it is. Got a good dodge off. Go for the down hit, down attack, and you should be in. <laughs> He's gone super sand. Oh shit! He stole an arm. He's doing a fucking Korean log and punch. Hell yeah. You're doing blackface, that's not allowed! <laughs> Mrs. Obama, get down! Oh shit, her sword broke. <gasps> Yo, his arm's cut off. Oh, he doesn't even care! What is this power? Oh! Come to me! Woo! Holy shit! <laughs> Look out! Oh, he's shooting bubble beam. He's a squirtle. Ow. I guess this is a dodge phase, maybe. He's got to get him with pod. Ah, oh, I can't believe I walked into that. I'm so dumb. Ooh. Man, this is scary. These bubbles are my worst enemy. Oh, that was close. In the middle of a, a dust cyclone. He's doing his fucking Aaron Jaeger like, gonna block Oh, he spirit bombed me! <laughs> NFT's destroyed. Ow! He hit me in the cutscene! Wait, why the fuck is my health bar so squishy? It's so fucky. What is that? What happened? What, what was that? Ferocious soldier. Saw a machine. Saw... A machine behind a tree. Smile. What's something... Something cool. Saw red eyes gazing down. In uh, the home of scrap iron. Let's do that. That's our poem. All right, we're gonna have to get our souls back. Give me another tricky. Oh man, it's cold in here. Jesus Christ! Are you guys warm? Is it warm where you are? Are you are you comfortable? Freezing it sucks around here. 
おおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお How do I get him? Shut up! He's deering. Whoa! All right, we got him down to a quarter. Oh, oh, Leslie! <laughs> <You're done. laughs> All right. So what's what's he done to us? What functionally has he done to us? Close range combat no longer operable. We gotta stay away. Go pods, come on! Ooh, no! Oh! Fuck! <laughs> How do I live? How do I live? Ah, help! Yeah, we, didn't want, we just want laser missiles. Come on! Get him, boys! Charge up! Everyone's here! Triple pods! No! No! Fuck off! We're so close! Alright, next time. Burning through our consumables. I hate it. I hate it. I hate needing to rely on consumables. I like having them, I just don't like using them. Do you guys stack up on, like, potions and... So, like, potions I'll use, but it's things like Attack Plus, Scroll of Summon Imp, and shit like that I just never, never use. Alright. At least we can stay very mobile. Whoa. That hurt. This is frustrating because, like, I'm just... You're not allowed to get close to him. He automatically runs away. So it's a game of keeping... Oika! Keeping off. It's a game of run away. Don't you think it's interesting that, like, regardless of where you are in the world, every child... Every, like, playground has the exact same, like, games. They're, they're all called different things. But everyone, every child, just, like, <laughs> it's coded into their DNA. They automatically know which games to play. And I guess, like, it could be said that it's a case of, all right, well, these are the kind of games that you see in the, uh, on TV. And also, it's like, what do we, what, what resources do we have available to us? We've got squares on the, on the, on the, on the concrete. We've got, um, we've got, oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? Oh. 
we've got squares on the concrete, we've got um, tennis balls and like maybe a yard. You know what I mean? Like maybe a grassy area. And, or a tree or some like location of interest. So it might be, it might come down to a, to a thing of, there's only so much you can do with, with limited resources. But yeah, I, I find it interesting that it's like regardless of culture as well, they're all always the same. Now the question is, do I have... The... Oh, what you gonna call them? The, the vampire chips installed. Ah, oh, man, she's so fast. That's a problem. Is uh, it's hard to weave because the tiniest little like wiggle sends her a decent distance. Can be a good thing, but in this specific situation, not not so great. This dude's just having his own, like, complete monologue over there. No, we don't have the- oh, we don't have the chips, okay. Uh, skills, plug-in chips, set type A, customize, all chips. Alright, we want... Uh, range attack up. We want... Range defense plus three. I'd rather have... Do we have... Whoa, we only have Deadly Heal. Ooh. Okay, how about... We get rid of this big boy. And we put on... Auto Heal. Anti-chain damage, resilience, Deadly Heal. Auto Heal plus one. Chuck that one on. And it gives us room for one more. So, what about... Crit up? No, that's huge. Crit up for seven. Still a bit too big. Crit up for six. And it's a plus one. Cannot be equipped. Uh, shockwave. Last stand. Counter. Counter plus one. Yeah, let's chuck that on there. We don't need damage numbers. I like that you can customize these elements of the HUD. I think it's cool. So we do have health regeneration capability. Outside of getting hits on. This is a... This is a oh, oh, sometimes you gotta move, sometimes you gotta stay still kind of thing. It's, it, it's difficult. Yosh! See that? Come on, Tubi, get up! NFC is a hustle. You destroyed our NFT catalogs. Can I shoot my laser? No, I can't. I'm not allowed. Ooh. Come on, as if. Oh, fuck. Woo! Oh, no. Not like this! We just gotta keep on him. Yosh! FFC is the hustle. Uh, slap him in the head! Kick him! Cut his head off! Cut his head off. Oh fuck! That's way more brutal. Jesus Christ! That was full on. Crap. 
credits roll. Ugh! That was a weird face. That was kind of gross. Ugh. You alright? You hungry? Oh, fuck. You got counterhacked. Don't make me kill my baby. Oh, no. No. Black box, come on. Activate. We'll just revert to our last save. Jeez. That's fucked up. Again, it's like Soma. <gasps> He's got the virus. He's got the virus. <laughs> I want to get killed by a fucking cyber GF. This is brutal. Oh my god, this is horrible. That was... Jesus Christ. This is full on. I wasn't expecting... <laughs> Only half an hour in the stream. So fucked up. <laughs> Are you guys like empathic? Because like this makes me want to cry. <laughs> Is it called empathic when like you just copy people's emotions? Who's you? I like her eyeball, look at that. I like the color. To be no, it's got green eyes, it means it's friendly. What's it saying? It's saying something in Morse code, probably. Happy robots? Question mark? Hello? Just wait, Tubi. You... Look, 
こうやって複数の自我が統合されていくのは貴重な体験だから記録しておきたいんだけどまだ保存領域へのアクセスができてなくて、yeah, no、worries, とりあえず敵のメモリーに多重化して保存領域が多くて僕が自分のボディに戻れたんですよかった<笑>機械生命体私たちアンドロイドを分かつものは何だろうか意思と感情を持つに至ったロボットたち彼らが死の間際に振り絞る最後の叫びが今もまだ私の中に残っている Oh wow OK Flower for machines. So that's ending A. I didn't know we were so close to the end. That was interesting. So we've got 25 endings to go, I think. I think I'll、uh, just listen. We'll, 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 we'll watch through the credits all the way. Matt Mercer's in it. Interesting. I had no idea that the, the, the story was like short, you know? Because、uh, we, 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 we've gone through the ending A in like 15 hours, less than. But I guess there's a lot more to go. This leaves, still leaves me with a lot of questions about humanity and where they, they fit into the story. Are the machines still around? Have、uh, Adam and Eve been there for forever, like since the initial alien invasion or the deployment of the machines? Look at all those violins a viola, a cello, a piccolo. Quack luck ink, hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Sounds good. The B tribe! That's me! I'm, I'm like, what, what's the emotion I have right now? I'm dubious, perhaps. Like, or, or I'm quizzical. I'm like, okay, that's not it though, right? You know what I mean? Like, how much did I miss? How much more is there to go? Because had I known that there was only like another 40 minutes of content, I would have just had like a really long stream the other day. But I do know that there's an ending for every letter of the alphabet. But which one are all of the endings the, the correct ending? Are they all. Like, 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 how much extra content does each ending add? I've got a new chair for my、uh, lounge room. I'm sitting in it at the moment, it's really good. You can kind of like rock around in it a little bit and bounce. It's pretty nice.、It、means if I'm streaming on the PlayStation, I can probably stream for a bit longer than normal because I'm not sitting on the floor <laughs> or leaning up against a thing that's uncomfortable. David Ribs.
I thought that's an alien Matsuoka. <laughs> it's Eileen. Alright, let's wiggle the stick for the boys while the credits play. Once I beat this game, I, I'm, I'm, as in like, not 100 percent it, you know, get every connectable, get every, blah, 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 but get all the endings, I'm wondering what to do next on the channel. I can't really decide. I, I do want to play Zone of the Enders, because I've never played that before, and I've never, like, the only thing I know about Zone of the Enders is that there's two of them, the second one's called Second Runner, is something about Mars... One battle ends. Notification from Square Enix. And that there's orbital frames and one of them's called Jehuti. To all players, thank you very much for playing Nier Automata. We have a very special message for you. This game has several different storylines that change each time you play. You have witnessed the A route, but there are still many story elements and changes to the gameplay systems you've not seen yet. We highly recommend you play through again to witness the full Nier Automata experience. We hope you enjoy the rest of the game. Sincerely, Square Enix Per. Voice change option added to the other options gallery. Save. Yes. Meow. To continue playing with the s to continue playing with the same save data you used to complete the game, select continue and load that save data. I will. Please. Please. Snake, turn off your PlayStation 4. In order to beat the mission. Hello? Do I actually have to. There it is. Near Automata. Press any button. Continue. From. Ending A. Start game. Let's go. I wonder where this leaves us, or where this starts us. And I wonder how we find these other endings. This is going to be the, the, the interesting part. Oh. <gasps> No! No! He's dead! Oh no! It was a cool big robot too! Yeah! Imagine if, like, we're just wandering around and then 2B just comes and fucking annihilates us and, like, air combos us and shit. What's our objective? Oh, we're not allowed to know. Look at this. I'll give my brother this. He'll move again. I need a container. There's a bucket over here. Yeah! I did not expect this. Does it splash every- Oh no! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I bet you can trip over this shit, too. Alright, we're not allowed to, uh... Not allowed to jump. Yeah, this is cool! I, I'm hoping this is the weird shit that starts happening now, you know? I, I just want, like, bizarre stuff to start occurring. Alright, we circumnavigated the pipe. Such a loyal little brother, look at him. Need that, need that, need that. 
He's got his sludge. Hey, brother, can I get some of that sludge? Only a spoonful. Alright, scan the eyes for androids coming to fucking annihilate me. Have some sludge. My ass, help him! Oh shit. Yo. Is this... The prequel? You know, and like, and like, we are now gonna reinforce 2B. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This is the start of the game. But from 9S's perspective, we can play as Luigi now. Oh, this is awesome. Who knew? We're setting up the level for <laughs> when we come back later, you know? Isn't that crazy? Nine S was last heard to say, "I can't control my curiosity about machines anymore. I'm leaving so I can study them as much as I want." He was never heard from again. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Hungry for knowledge, ending G. He just fucks off. He just yeets away forever. You, lo you fucking loser. I thought I was supposed to go that way. Well, I guess in a sense I was, you know, because it was an ending. It was technically an ending. I hope I don't have to do the fucking oil bit again. <laughs> Hell yeah. Ag. 9S died on the way back to his home planet. And we can, uh, we can easily get ending W, I think. That's when you, uh, take your op operating chip out. And then there's also the self-destruct ending, too. Alright, we gotta get the fucking... We gotta speedrun this. Not now, mum. I'm clutching. Calm down, love. Alright, let's go. Ugh. Get some of that sludge. They call him the sludge runner. The dredge runner. The sludge brother. All right, we must make sure to take it slow and steady when we become 9S. Also, do you reckon we can see him from here? Keep your eyes peeled, he could be anywhere. Whoa! That's what that was before. Little garbage chute coming in. I hope we come back to this little dude's story. Because this is a little sad vignette, and I, I hope to find out what happens to him later. Alright. Board the flight unit. Let's go! Where's our flight unit? Oh, there it is. View the map or perform quick save. I will. Fuck. Uh, let's go see that little boy down there. Alright, 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 alright. All right, all right. I don't want to get that ending again.
Man, the flight units are cool in this. They are so cool. And then we come in and we save 2B from the big uh, uh, shovel robot. Oh shit, here we fucking go. What's up? This is interesting because we have to learn their journey again. Like, like, we have to go through their character development all over again. It's fascinating. Oh, we're hacking! Woo! Okay, so if I press Y, I can hack. That is fascinating. Fire! We got we got new mechanics. Oh, yosh. Oops, wrong button. Keep forgetting. Fuck me. That's that laser sword is so so good. And here we go. Oh, sorry. I'm hacking. I'm raining down fucking so much carnage. Oh, fuck, what is this? Ow, 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 ow. It'd be cool if they fought on my team when, uh... When they... When they get hacked? Charge up. Do I have to hold it down? Yeah, I'm holding it down. There we go. There we go. That's what we want. Don't worry, I've been hacking every... Since the moment I had control, I've been hacking. I'm like Rami Malik. All right, this garbage can is now mine. Whoa, just, I love the mobility, just being able to dodge. Time it well, it's just awesome. Unleash! Get out of here! Charge up my hacking beam! Go through the little hacking maze. I, <laughs> I guess you can call this a hack and slash game. Alright, two targets to go. I would simply dodge. Guys, come! Stays in the corner here. Bob, Bob, Bob! Unleash! Cool. 
Hopefully the hole. Let's go. Who's around? Who's who's here still? I guess these wall tarts perhaps. Boop. Activate. Reveal. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh. I think I found you. Is it time now? Yes. In we go. Into the mainframe, into the cyber cyber realm. It's really cute that little uh, that little symbol, the little space and not space invaders, the little symbol for the uh, the hacker ship. Hi. He's a little shit at the start, this 9S. He's a little baby. Oh, the plays! The gamer plays! I like how the music pixelates. In a way, it becomes more like a chip tune. Chip tune uh, as the hacking sequence like it begins. It's not even as soon as you get here, but it's as the uh, as the hacking charges up. This is fantastic. What's that? What's that movie where it, 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 it's all about like I am Kaiso Sui? And it's all it's, it's one story, but from four different perspectives, and you don't know which one's true. Let's try spinning. That's a good trick. Yeah. You sit in the middle. Once you get in in between the little spires, you're fine. Boop. Out of the Mario pipe. Yeah, look at this. Hell yeah. <laughs> there it is. There's that boy. This is fascinating. He's throwing me off like these different camera angles. Let's go. Back in we go. This is cool. In the other side of the coin, you know. Meanwhile, Man. He's a lone wolf. Emotions are prohibited. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> Shit, I did not mean to do that. Oh, 
Oh, the music though. Oops. Oh yeah. That's my dodge. I keep forgetting I have that. How can I, how could I forget that? It's like the most poor piece of gameplay. I guess I'm just an idiot. There it is. He's a killing machine, that 9S. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, it's like a little peek behind the oh my god. A little peek behind the curtain. While two V's off doing baby mode easy tutorial mission. We're here fighting level 28. <laughs> This is kind of funny, you know? Fucking look at him go! Look at this boy! Yeah, 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 yeah! Alright, my brain's becoming... ...addled. Yeah! I feel like it, it feels like Ninus is just here to fuck around, you know? Two V's here on the mission and he's just like flying through little tunnels and playing Galaga. Oh my, 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 my right thumbstick is getting all like, oh! Oh, the gamer boy, the gamer boy. Hope she's not fighting two big uh, shovels right now. Oh, this is awesome! Now we get to fucking do this bit while TV does other stuff. Alright, what are we aiming for? We've got to hack into its uh, fucking arm. There it is! Oh, he's coming for me! Ooh. I wonder if- oh, I just want to turn the camera around and then, like, see what 2B's doing right now, you know? I think that'd be- that'd be awesome. There it is, we got him! 
Angels? That's his name? <gasps> we didn't have a name for him before. We only had like weird, weird, um, winding symbols. Oh, what does this mean? There it is. Oh! There it is from the cutscene. Play this part as 9S, you know? What do we do? Do we have to like stagger around like with one arm and one leg for a bit? Or does it just skip to 2B coming in? Oh! What is this? Oh my god. Recovery sector. Eliminate access impairments to all blocks. There's a little maze to go through. Visual system. Alright, we gotta turn the eyeballs back on. Boop, boop, boop. Alright, eyeballs activated. Let's get our ears working again. Oh god, we only have two minutes? This is interesting. Voice on. Okay, we can hear and we can see. We're back! That was cool. うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。うるさい。
We don't have super functional functionality. All right, line them up. Unflate fire. Oh God. No! Ooh. All right, let's go. Let's get him. Let's activate the arm. Here she is. This one. Please. To be, I'm sending up a flare. Get the other arm too, don't worry. Ow. Good sounds. Good soundtrack. Hack his brain. Grab it! Protect baby. What a hero. What a good boy. He's such a good boy. What do we do to deserve 9S? So loyal, so cute. So playful. Alright, let's go! Oh! That was close! I like that the music is like I'm positive the soundtrack is different here too. I swear I would have remembered if the soundtrack was like the the bunker theme for this for this part uh, originally. I feel like it was more actiony. We know how this ends. What the hell, like, much of the game we need to go back through as 9S? Are we doing going to do another 15 hours as 9S? And then get ending B, perhaps? Who knows? Let's wait and see. Because, like, for quite a lot of it, 9S is with us as 2B. Like, like, we're together. So surely we're not doing the whole game over again. We're going to do those areas where he's isolated from 2B. Like when he's captured by Adam, perhaps, in the sunken city, or the copied city. Here comes that Goliath Titan in the back. Looking like a Lucius t class Titan Titan, whatever.
What's these little column mean? You know? What's the deal with that? That little X. What's the, what's, what's the story behind that? Is there a reason or is it just because it looks cool? I got caught halfway between, between saying cute and cool. <laughs> it's cool, bro. It's pretty cool. It's coot. C O O T. Here we go. Sate to. Soro soro jikan dana. Two bees on the set up or tetsdaini kanakana. Tabu. Mo here de matter daroma. We have awoken. Let's see what kind of dialogue and stuff we can get as 9S. And let's save the game. Oh, <gasps> you've unlocked arcade? Replay any hacking games you completed during the game. Challenge mode. Attempt a hacking game? Yeah, sure. Oh! You died. Instantly. How far can we go? It's survival. Nope. Okay. New record. Three. Any, uh, any emails? That is... Okay, this is from 2B. Uh... Same stuff. Yep. So nothing unread. Alright. Let's see if there anyone is... Ooh, ooh, ooh. I can't speak. Let's see if anyone's hanging around that we can uh, talk to. Terminal, not really. I just want to see if anyone's in this hallway. <gasps> Mail. What's up, Tubi? Hack Tubi's brain. Tubi san, you can Oh, we're doing the test. <laughs> Yo, how's your brightness settings, too, B? Do I have to do it again? Oh my god. Hang on. Is this... Okay, okay. I thought that that was the recording of when oh, I played through this, like, initially. I thought that'd be so fucked. That'd be some next level stuff. Nice. <laughs> ちんぱいはいりませんよ。僕たち あ、そうだ。わかりました。司令官が呼んでたから一緒に行きましょう。トゥビさん。あいや、トゥビ。チェックアウトイメールズ。データをセーブするにはアクセスポイントに近い場所じゃないとできません。近距離マップで確認してこ
This message is intended for the verification of your mail account. Members who encounter problems with the mailing system should contact their supervisors as soon as possible. Email. I'm always excited for emails. Not like in real life, though. Nope. Alright, let's go. This is strange. This is strange. Ah, to be ka. Maintenance wa watta no ka? Hi. Black box no bosso ni yoru teki senmetsu. Amari mucha o suru na yo. Hi. Maintenance ake de ware ga nimu ga aru. Chijou ni iru registance tachi to gouryu shi. Jouhou shushu o shite kure. Alrighty. Back again. Let's go see all the fellas. Go see an enemy. Meet the fellas. Again, I wonder how much of the game we'll need to do again, and how uh, how much repetition there will be. I'll race you there. There we get tired of looking at Earth. Hang on, I can get through from the elevator to my left. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, quest. I feel so good. Balance senses. Blah, 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 blah. Going down to earth. Yup, 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 yup. Right, so same old, same old stuff, same old dialogue. And off we go, the return to earth. Uh, for the first time, again. And we're the black one now. Hey, 2B, hey. hey. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's me now. It's my show. I'll take the left, you take the right, 2B. Oh my god. Yeah, the odd thing is we've been using that, like, you know, since the instant we, we began this, like, second gig. Right, I've got a... Uh, I've got a two-hand controller now. I was uh, wiggling the stick for the cat. <laughs> While I was just moving around the bunker. Oh, here they come. Get in there, you get in there, oodle loop. Hit him with the rockets. Alrighty. mean to do that. Oh, we got that... all of our chips and stuff installed from last time. Interesting. 
Yo, you reckon we still got our like bag? Our feed bag, our animal bag? We do. Let's go. It's red. This is odd. <laughs> this is very odd. Sorry, dude. Must be like. Ooh. Have you guys ever seen a? Ooh! You guys ever seen a moose in real life? I have not. I want to. I've seen like a one at a museum, like a, a taxidermy moose, and it was fucking huge. Imagine a moose running at you. Wouldn't that be crazy? Wouldn't that be fucked up? リーダーに情報を聞いてみましょうよ。お前たちは。二号。で、ナンバー 2。このエリアの調査担当になったらしいな。情報は私よりも他の連中の方が詳しいだろう。私を通さなくていいから好きに聞いてくれ。Alright. Do our weapon trader quests. So, we uh we do these quests again. It's fine because we can just skip the dialogue. There's no need. Ooh. Ooh. He's already all set up. Ah, there we go. There we go. There we go. There it is. That's the supply request. <laughs> hey man, I had this from my last playthrough, brother. I, I did a time loop. I did a time skip, bro. Hey, man. I actually had this shit the whole time, bro. And he's gonna talk about how his leg is like his only leg. Who's you? Um, you guys still want your quest from up here? No, these are just doodads. These are just fellas. Hey man, I want a new music box. Oh no, wait a minute, they've already got there. <gasps> Look at that. We've already got access. Of course we do. Of course we do. Alright, let's uh, finish the quests that we literally just started. Hey man, I actually had your shit the whole time. No, I actually, I don't have it right now. What's up, lady? Hey, yo, yo, my mask. It's a, I, uh, I'm wearing a cool, cool mask. Alright. So I guess we go into the desert again, right? Uh, let's find a moose. Let's find a beast. Is this guy got a shield? I love Operator san. Don't you fucking say a bad word about her. She's best girl. Oh, yeah, we didn't fucking learn anything about A2 in that ending A end. 
I wonder what is going to... Uh, what her deal is going to be. What do you guys reckon? Don't say if you know. <laughs> do you reckon she'll join the party? Do you reckon that's going to be like... Route C is going to be her story? Like the hit video game, her story? Fuck! Yeah, that's what I wanted. <laughs> you absolute buffoon. Yeah, I like shoot from afar. That's awesome. He's got like a death wall coming in. Woo! Ow. That's cool. That's really cool. Ow, ow, ow. <gasps> Leave my little baby alone! Oh shit, I keep forgetting that, that that's my hack button. Alright, take out all these little shapes. This is what cyberspace is like. This is what's happening inside your computer right now. My stream is one of these little arrows and it's flying across the world to your computer. This is how it works. What, you gonna tell me I'm wrong? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, yeah, for sure you've seen how the internet works, bro. What, are you gonna trust a scientist? Ew. <laughs> Yuck. Hang on, we gotta hack his shield off. Hold on, hold on. And we gotta update the Yoha library as well for hacking mini games. Do we have any pod functions? We do not. What was that? <gasps> a dead person! We can pray for them. I thought of my beloved looking down on Earth. That's nice. Soggy Doggy Jake! <laughs> Hell yeah! Oh. I wonder if... 9S can get different weapons. Get all of our items that we need. Fascinating. Absolutely fascinating. Let me just refresh this. <sighs> Fuck, I'm cold. I'm so cold. I wish to be warm. I wish to become toast. We're in my Edward Ember Pants, Ember Pants merch today. They're nice. They're very comfortable. You guys seen uh, the Adventures of Edward Ember Pants from Kraken's stream, from Kraken's YouTube channel? It's very good. It's very silly. I recommend watching it <laughs> if you've not seen it. I actually just want to play Dark Souls again. Or Demon Souls. Vardy had a good video today. Vardy Video had a good video today. Uh, about Demon's Souls lore. Uh, and it was cool. It was, it was, yeah, it was pretty cool. I liked it. I watched it over lunch. Alright, where's this last item? Oh, there's a couple. Let's do the whip forward move. There it is. 
There we go. Back we go. Let's take a moose real quick. No? Yes? Um, it is this way. Here are some of the fellas. And look, this is giving me PTSD, this area here. Because of that sphere. Come on, let's get out of here. Come on, Doobie. Use your pod to whip. Oh, look at that. It looks like the brand of sacrifice on the minimap. Hey, man. I got your stuff. Whee! Let's get some story lore. For the, uh, for the weapons we got. Alright. Upgrade. We can upgrade Virtuous Dignity. Let's do it. Upgrade Virtuous Treaty and Upgrade Virtuous Contract. That's as far as we can take it, but there are craftsmen in the world who can raise it to level 4. If I ever meet someone like that, I'd want them to teach me all they knew. Come to me whenever you need help with your weapons. Okay, 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 okay. Let's check them out. Let's check out the weapon laws. Virtuous contract. How long can I fight amidst this bloody vortex of a battlefield? How long, I wonder? How long can I continue to protect what I love amidst this endless war? How long, I wonder? How long can I continue to believe in a world laden with deceit and folly? How long, I wonder? Cruel Oath. A black blade used by warriors of the East. A black oriental store, a sword. It's no frills design gives it an aura of serious weaponry. Once long ago, there was a group of seven boys who were born in the same village. Though, as they were not brothers by blood, they treated each other as family. We got the, the story of the machine sword. Um, the more old records I read, the more fascinated I become by the species known as humans. We machines must do all we can to preserve these precious artifacts and to, to continue to record their contents. I see from these records how important predation and reproduction were to human survival, and yet they've used such acts as sinful. I wonder why. Uh, do we get any new Beast Lord lore? The princesses... Virtuous Treaty... First encounter with my lover, failed to connect with my lover. Far away went my lover. Good little poems. Virtuous Dignity. The elegant white spear was crafted by a tyrant as a gift for his wife, whose parents he had killed years earlier. She slipped it under the bed as they shared, then later used it to run him through thirty times. The spear's second owner was a courageous bandit-fighting mare. In her later years, her strength faded until one night, a pack of young thugs surrounded her and took all that she had, including her life. Jesus Christ. Uh, yep, we've seen that one. Alright, cool. Uh, what swords do we want on, on our boy? Ooh, yeah, let's keep Cruel Oath. Uh, and weapon set two, you can have... Virtuous Dignity, Machine Spear, Beast Lord, Virtuous Treaty, Virtuous Contract. Oh, it's just color. Machine Sword. Nah, I gotta give our boy a spear. Let's give him Virtuous Dignity. Alright. Talk to an enemy. Hey, an enemy. Yep, she's talking about like, yo, there's some shit uh, happening in the desert. You should go check it out. And we're like, yeah, no worries, dude. Don't even worry about it. We'll, we'll, we'll do it for you. Reckon we can travel yet? Yes! No! <laughs> shit. Could only transport to the bunker, but we can ride a beast. We got, we got an email to read. 
さすがオペレーターさんさすがオペレーターさんさすがさすがオペレーターさんさすがオペレーターさんさすがオペレーターさんさすがオペレーターLike little chip tune remixes are gorgeous. They're so good. I love them. The support to be. Let's uh, let's try and we'll try and alter to be's combat style too. Hack the armor. Take his torso. Ow. Ow. Right, how do we deal with these guys? What is it that we need to remove? There it is. Take out the core! Our, our, uh, we haven't got any like ultimates for our. for our. Oh! Christ almighty, for our big gun, our, our pod yet. I do, I do want to beat these guys purely because we haven't beat them before. These golden fellas. Got him down! Come on, 2B. It's so strange seeing 2B like suck so much. You know? Because usually she's the awesome one. To be please. All right. Go, 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 go.
There it is. These things. All right, we need an ally. Fight for Dennis with a three and a five. We need Dennis on our side. I can't do this by myself. These guys are so tough. They have so much health. What the fuck is going on? Why? Please. Switch into the spear. Right, now we've got to hack. This is the only way. It's the only way. I can't believe how long this fight is taking. Hack that guy's legs off. Ooh. Get it. Use the hack, use the cyber terrain to our advantage. Scary. Oh god, my brain is gonna fucking explode. Ah, so many patterns, so many colors. <laughs> Who's saying that? Get out of here! I guess this just shows how good 2B is, you know? I reckon if, if we were 2B, we'd be clowning on these fools. Whipping them in the air, doing combos. All that good stuff. That we know and love are, uh, are for. We gotta be the support- no, we, we- We've gotta hack into death. Oh my god. Hey man. Oh, goodness gracious. That was full on. Alright, well we got some lore on them. Uh, Intel. Unit data. Standard machines. Small stubby. Reverse jointed galite. Yup, yup, yup. Small exploder. Small sphere. This spherical or machine life form requires tremendous energy to stay afloat, so offense is not its strong suit. It offsets this by equipping weapons that are powerful enough to make up for its inherent lack of strength. Linked sphere type. This combination of multiple spherical machines is sometimes transported into combat by its comrades. Its many variations are a result of its unusual construction, which emphasizes a flexibility above all else. Rampaging tall stubby. Punished stubby. A machine life form that has become violent after infection by Eve will attempt to attack androids as if they were prey. The armor plating on its head has been removed, revealing teeth like metal pipes that nevertheless have no functionality as a mouth. It is theorized that either this modification was implemented uh, due to self optimization or that possibly some alien race created them in likeness to themselves, though neither of these are proven. Rampaging poor, tall biped. Rampaging medium biped. Desert Machines. Uh, forest Kingdom Machines. 
Yeah, look at these fucking boys. The most common of the small machine life forms. The unit, yeah, 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 yeah. Tip of its spear is made uh, of painstakingly refined metals and can pierce even androids' armor. Medium quadruped. A four-legged machine, medium-sized machine life form that resembles an animal. Occasionally seen with smaller machines riding on its back, this unit attacks using the great mobility afforded by its legs. The tip of its limbs are equipped with wire cutters that can be used in combat, while the tail segment is actually a collapsible claw-like arm. This variant resembles a human when upright, its slim body allows it to attack with unusual swiftness. Factory machines. Small stubby. Uh, occasionally machine life bombs can be found carrying torches in dark places. As machines are thought to be capable of seeing in the dark, it's assumed they have some other reason for this behavior. They tend to their, use their own vital fluids as fuel for the torches, though the meaning of this, if there is one, is also unknown. The weight of its axe gives overwhelming destructive power wield... Small flyer. Village machines. Small stubby. Machine life forms that are a part of the colony at Pascal's village. Despite their machine origins, they despise conflict in all forms and willingly cut themselves off from the network as a result. They are now live a peaceful existence deep in the forest along with other machines who share their pacifistic beliefs. Multi-tier. Small bipid. Medium bipid. Goliath bipid. Small flyer. Small Sphere. Pascal, the pacifist machine life form that despises conflict and strives endlessly for peace with humanity. This unit possesses incredible intelligence as well as a deep interest in the history of both humans and machines. Father Machine, a machine life form that plays the role of father. Although he leaves the job of caring, plays his children entirely up to the mother. Mother Machine, a machine life form that plays the role of mother. She reached out to 2B and 9S after a fight with her child caused him to run away. A story which serves as proof that familial bonds exist amongst machines. Coolant leaked from the mother's eyes when her missing child finally returned home. Despite the lack of network access causing disagreements among her family, she still spoke happily of the incredible joy to be found in understanding. Child Machine. The child machine life form that fled home after a fight with his mother. Big Sister Machine. A machine life form searching for her lost little sister. She ventured into the desert after hearing her sibling complain about the poor conditions of her past, of her parts. This story serves as proof that sisterhood exists among machines. Little Sister Machine. A little sister machine life form that got lost in the desert. According to Pascal, she's a good-natured girl who cares deeply for her older sister. Filled with curiosity, she spent most of the trip home bombarding 9S with uncountable questions. She returned home on her own after being escorted to the desert's entrance. Enhanced Machines uh, Machine life forms covered in red and black paint. While they resemble standard machines aside from the color scheme, their internal specs are actually above average. Small Special Machine Units Marks Engels Adam Okay, so we, we can update like the, with the full story that, 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 that that's, that's happened. This unit has achieved an unusual level of evolution among machine life forms as it possesses a strong resemblance to androids. Born naked from a cocoon of machine life forms, its movement was initially quite clumsy. It grew rapidly, however, and began, uh, promptly began learning new methods of attack. Adam was again encountered inside the alien mothership. Strangely enough, he spends part of that fight lecturing his foes about how the aliens met their end at the hands of the machines. Deeply fascinated with mankind, he seeks to dissect the surviving humans on the moon. Adam also appeared in the copied city. His fascination with humanity led him to create... led him to created... lead him to create... Uh, his fascination with humanity led him to create the copied city in an attempt to imitate them. He then separated himself from the network and put his life on the line against 2B in an attempt to better under understand the concepts of life and death. While he eventually gained the knowledge he sought, the price was his own life. Eve. Whoa, final battle. This unit has achieved an unusual level of evolution among machine life forms. Um, 
uh, as it possesses a strong resemblance to androids, it first appeared after splitting off from another machine. Eve was again encountered in the alien mothership. He has the ability to regenerate, no matter how many times he is killed, and adores the unit known as Adam, who he thinks of as an older brother. After going mad with rage over the loss of Adam, Eve gained the ability to unleash powerful attacks with an arm clad in debris. Thanks to the desperate hacking work of 9S, he was eventually separated from the, ne from the network and killed. Goliath Tank Amusement Park. Simone. A Goliath-class machine lifeform modeled after an opera singer, this unit attacked foes using the repurposed bodies of living androids. Obsessed with a certain other machine lifeform, she put great thought into her appearance, even going so far as to cannibalize her own kind. Alas, such garish decorations only ended up being a spectacular display of poor taste. Her search for beauty eventually led her led to her demise when she attacked 2B in 9S. Goliath Flyer. The big boy. A flying Goliath-class machine lifeform with a tank-like machine attached to its bottom section. During combat, the center portion functions as a hangar that can release numerous small flying machines, while the main body is capable of firing large quantities of energy rounds. Grun. Look at him. He's huge. It's crazy to like look at it in this scale when this thing is like a kilometer tall. That's an entire level on his back there. Look at that. It's just an entire zone. A machine lifeform of extreme size that was developed specifically to annihilate androids. However, due to its tendency to also attack its fellow machines, it was eventually discarded in this, into the sea. The part that was initially thought to be its entire body turned out to be merely its head, causing this colossus to reach over 1,000 meters into the sky when standing. Seemingly invincible due to a powerful EMP defense and thick armor, the unit was eventually destroyed when 9S directed missiles straight into its mouth. Emmanuel. This small machine life form, known as the Forest King, was destroyed following the sudden appearance of the android A2. Kierkegaard. The machine life forms who formed a colony in the abandoned factory worshipped this particular unit as their founder. He has since ceased to function, which his followers take proof that he has become a god. Shoshi. A multi-legged Goliath-class machine lifeform equipped with two massive blades. By emitting energy from the tips of its legs, it can move around as though gliding across the ground. The unit's side serves as weapon racks that can launch missiles and other projectiles, while additional plating attached to the legs reinforces its weak armor. When the situation demands it, the unit can purge this plating and transform into a spherical form capable of spin attacks. Bokushi, multi-legged uh, Goliath class machine life form, equipped with an offensive firearm unit, this long-range menace can also emit electricity from the tips of its legs, turning nearby water-covered surfaces into danger zones. Androids. A2. The A model is a Yorha prototype that specializes in close quarter combat. Though not presently in use, it was originally created to speed along the implementation of other official models such as 2B and 9S. This particular unit, whose official title is Class A Number 2, was wanted by command for desertion and ordered to be destroyed on sight. She first appeared in the Forest Castle, where she slew the Forest King. 2B and 9S managed, uh, engaged her in combat, but she managed to escape. Peculiar Machines, Courageous Brother. A small golden stubby that accompanied by the followers of the same color, they shout glory to machine lifeforms as they attack. Gold Goliath Biped, a Golden Goliath class biped that is accompanied by small stubbies of the same color. Zombie Clown, this machine lifeform which resembles a clown has assimilated stamps into its body. It lures victim with offers of play before spewing an unknown liquid from its mouth that is toxic enough to melt the skin of androids. Upon defeat, it offers thanks for playing with it. Amicable Machines, Romeo, one of the other machine lifeforms known as Romeo, after spewing a non-stop diatribe of abuse, he suddenly descended into a murderous rampage. Juliet, one of the machine lifeforms known as Juliet. After spewing a non-stop diatribe of abuse, she suddenly descended into a murderous rampage. She managed to survive the bloodbath that took the lives of her fellow Romeo and Juliet, but killed herself soon thereafter due to grief over the loss of her beloved. Animal loving machine. Yeah! It's my fucking boy! It's me! That's me as a robot. 
Look at that. Can this be an emote? Oh, I want, I want this. Look at him. Yeah, look at him go! Oh, he's so cool. Oh yeah. A machine life form that appeared riding atop a boar. It mistakenly attacked 2B and 9S under the impression that they were harming local animals, but reached reconciliation after the misunderstanding was cleared up. Caring for weak and injured animals in a corner of the forest castle, this animal loving unit has an extremely kind heart. Any fish that we haven't learnt about yet? Starfish. This critter uses its five arms to move about, while the mouth at its centre inhales dead fish and clams. Despite the appearance, it's actually quite friendly and will often move closer to you if you try and touch it. Gross. Starfish Machine. A machine life form resembling a starfish. Its mobility is roughly the same as a regular starfish, so it's hard to imagine this creature was designed to have an impact on aquatic life. To this day, researchers have not reached a consensus on why it exists. Gas Cylinder. A storage container for fuel used by the resistance. These cylinders are highly explosive, so improperly disposing of them is strictly forbidden. A code engraved on the bottom of the cylinder allows it to be tracked by the owner, who is then promptly punished by your heart. Alright. Off we go to the desert. To continue the great story. Oh, look at that. He fucking yoinks it. That's cool. I mean. Oh, we are hot, Nani. We're good. Uh, let's check out emails. Lost equipment. There's something I forgot to mention prior to your sortie. Uh, shit in the um, factory. <laughs> Alrighty, let's roll. Here he is, he's the boss. Where's that 2B? Here she is. Alright, let's uh To be, I wanna change your uh, combat style. Aggressive. It's Jackass. We've had a chat with her. She blew shit up. She's cool. We gotta go and fight. Oh man, they're level 30. Oh, there we go. There's that 2B we know and love. Awesome. And here we are. The desert. Off we go into the dunes. Oh, look at the penetration of that. 
最近になって増えたんだろう Yeah, we can charge up our bop. Look at that. My goodness. He just yoinks it super hard. Got good arm on him, that 9S. Good on him. Cheeky little fella. I really don't need these items, like, at all. Oh, he dodged. Getting in there. Popping them up. Oh. Our boy. Look at him go. You love him. You love to see it. The power of these lads. The little fella. The boy in his boy shorts coming to get you. Alright, access point. Here we go. Down we go. Continue the fight. Ooh! Combat, so we just get a nice heal going. Let's check the map real quick. Yeah, there's something up here. Let's see if we can access that. Because we couldn't last time. But let's see if we can get it. I reckon 9S would be able to scoot through the fog. I mean, through the. Whatchamacallit? Here we go. Quest from the lad. Whoa, 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 watch your step. There might be ancient relics buried just beneath the first surface. Hmm, me? I'm researching the old world. You guys are with your, uh, with your heart, right? Say, find anything in the desert that looks like a relic. And bring it to me? I'll find a way to reward you for the trouble. Heritage of the past. Alright, let's get some relics. Alright, we need to go to our pod program. Pod A is going to have scanner as its secondary function. See that in the distance? What is that? Oh, look at 2B go. She's doing combos, dude. Oh, imagine if this was co-op. Oh, that'd be sick. Get over here! Keep your ears open. We're on the hunt for relics. Close. 
I found one. Mysterious lithograph number two. Let's have a look at it. <gasps> yeah! Take it off. <laughs> Take it off right now. Let's see if I can look at that uh, lithograph. Natural rubber, giant egg. Key items. Condiment slab. Slabs of the laws of an ancient country written upon it. Commandment slab. I thought it said condiment slab. <laughs> Why did I think that? What does that even mean? Okay, are we headed in the right direction? Seems to be no improvement. Yep, there's this little fella. Beast on him for a bit. All right, let's head back to the uh, the the wasteland worker. See if we can find any more stuff for him. I wonder how many things there are in total. Hopefully not too many. Oh! What the fuck is that? That is awesome. I want that as a weapon, please. Yeah, super laser gun. Like, no, I was going to say AoE, but no, it's like a beam weapon. Oh, it's raining from the sky. <laughs> Alright, let's scuttle on through. Deliver some items. Age stick obtained. Through the law. Age stick. Stick of unknown purpose. It's Moses' stick. I guess that kinda tells us where we are, right? Hey man, got some stuff for you. Looks like some kind of staff. That's pretty incredible. Let me pay for your help. It was likely a tool used for some kind of ceremony. I imagine it belonged to the nation that used to exist in this region. If you find any more relics, make sure to bring them to me. 
Thanks, brother. Got another one for you. Ah! Stone tablet with laws written upon it. That's definitely worth a reward. This isn't the only tablet of its kind that we've found, either. I think that the nation that once existed here lived under an almost impossible number of rules. The more they expanded their civilization, the more rules they had to come up with. They ended up living their lives bound by rules. Seems like a waste if you ask me. If you find any more relics, make sure to bring them to me. Thanks for the thick dictionary. What did he mean by this? Let's just keep this bad boy open while we while we progress to our next area. Look at this boy, he's Naruto running. He's got that anime speed. Alright, let's go into the uh, city ruins. Through the sand waterfall we go. I swear this is beeping faster. No, I think it's just me. Oh well. Thought I was onto something. I got excited. Up in the uh, in the hill hills there, in the rocky outcrop, the hill folk. <sighs> I just don't want to deal with those guys. I don't like them. They're frustrating. All right, through we go. What is that down there? See that? I thought it was a tank. it being presented in that style. What was that? Desert tank. Golden desert tank. Oh, fuck. Oh, I've got to dash around. Ooh, they got heat seeking rockets. There it is. We busted through. There's the little fella. He's a tough one. Who are these golden boys? Wow, look at that, that's pretty. Ow! Uh, uh, uh. Back in we go. I'm jacking in.
Ooh! No. <laughs> Go! Oh god. Oh my god. Oh, it freaks me out so much, dude. I can't deal with it. Oh, the cubes! Leave me alone! Oh, I'm leaning forward in my chair. <laughs> We gotta flank him. Gotta use our speed to our advantage. That should be it. Who is that little fucking golden boy? What is his... What is this guy's story? What's his deal? Oh, there's something. Like an orb. Machine core. I think these guys can only be harmed by hacking. The new type of enemy. Hacking is like magic. You know, you have like anime sigils appear around you. It doesn't cost MP though. Yes, that's got it's why it's one thing it's got going for it. There he is. Oh, last one. Got some hits in though. Who are you? Who are you? Wait. Is he? Is he the guy from the beginning? Oh, <gasps> maybe he's the guy we play it as with the bucket. What do you think? Do you reckon it could be him? Because he's talking about his brother. That's fucked up. we go. Yes. Oh, even Ninus has got the air combos going. What a fucking legend. Here he is. Konnichiwa, bitches. Nine S just doing the, some fucking work. Good on him. The team, they're just so strong. The dynamic duo. The dynamic quad 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 quartet, that's the word. Because we got pods, we got two, we got a pod each. Alright, summon Helling Wet. Helling Wet has become your ally. 
Oh god, only level 7, they're gonna get annihilated. They're fucking dead, dude. Can you level up in death? Can your XP return to you? After you do an away mission for us? Switches to the fucking sword! What a legend! Oh, 9S, so cool! Yeah, the, the thing that I've never been able to get with these kind of, like, shmups is the magic pixel and understanding and remembering where that is. It's a concept that's just eluded me. Jalos ja, ja logistic. You are now mine. You work for Dario now. Alright, we wanna stay on the orange side because these are areas that we can deal with. And we can shoot through the orange bolts. There it is. There it is. There it is. All right, let's go. Let's go and see the birth of the machines again. <laughs> Shimata. They have such foul mouths, these androids. They're saying shit, piss, and calm, and all these rude words. They're saying heck. この Hang on. <gasps> it's him! He's here again! I rock my dog 69! It's him! Remember? Wow. I saw T. I was like, wait a minute. Wait a fucking second. Kodomo. Kodomo. Kodomo, bro. Kodomo. Hug. Hug. There he is! Oh, fuck! Even 9S is doing combos. Even Speedwagon is afraid. Shit. Here they come. Oh. This cannot continue. Remember from the song. Oh. 
They're charging it up. Ow. Woo! I like their dive bomb attacks. Here it comes. Kingdom Hearts looking ass. It's like Kingdom Death. He's awoken into the world. Oh, he's got double cores. No, he doesn't. Yes, he does. Oh, fuck. That's hard. Katana. You <laughs> Katana! Yeah, I think this is one of my favorite tracks in the game. Ba 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 So good. Music's amazing. La la lu le lu le lu la la lu le lu le lu. Let's get that purple blood, brother. And that dusty butt. And then out he comes, slippering and slithering in. Let's go. Oh. All right, we're safe now. ourselves to the access point. It's interesting that we have to go through all of it again. I don't know if I'm a huge fan of that. Come on, Tubi, wanna help me with this one, please? I'm only a small baby. Oh. 
Brutal. You gotta assist. You have to be the support character. Which is interesting. I, I usually like being support in like MMOs <laughs> or multiplayer games. Can we support in a single player game? シレルトの通信できるようになりました。何月からバンカーへ応答をお願いします。オペレーター有利ライン受信しました。先ほど人型つまりアンドロイドに似た質感を持つ機械生命体と遭遇しました。残念ながら取り逃がしましたが、その時